Hello everybody and today's video is going to be on retakes. So as most of you probably guessed, we were going to get another cat and you may be thinking, my lordy, it's a bit scary because she looks so much like Ozzy. Um, but it was typical that when we went to the Blue Cross, because we rescued her, um, when we went to the Blue Cross, it was just had to be typical that the cat we fell in love with was the same colour as Ozzy. As you can see by her now, she is just so relaxed, so gorgeous, aren't you? I'm actually surprised how her reaction and she just loves humans. And you can see this is her second day and how relaxed she is. We bring her home last night. So she hasn't even been with us for 24 hours yet. And she's so settled. So we all really love her. And yeah, I just wanted to do this video of showing you her. Yeah. <laughs> um, so this isn't um, anything about her story. Um, this is literally meat takes. So <laughs> you can tell she's very affectionate. And I just missed having a cat so much. It was really hard not having a cat. Where are you going? Hey? Where are you going? You can't leave the camera. Thank you. <laughs> As you guess, it's really hard not having a cat and you all know how much Ozzy meant to me. Um, and if you didn't know, Ozzy was my past cat and he died from getting stuck in a car bonnet, which was horrible. The worst experience I've had to experience in my life. I'm still really shaky about it, so I'm not going to talk much more, but Ozzy will always be remembered, and this cat is not to replace Ozzy in any shape, way, or form, even though she's practically the same colour. Um, it's complete coincidence, and I promise you this, that the cat we got sent Tins to look like Ozzy, but she's gorgeous, and we love her, and she's four, and she's a domestic domestic um, short haired cat so she's not Bengal like Ozzy. Not Bengal are you? No. <laughs> she hasn't been aggressive at all yet at all either. She's um, completely calm and as you can see she keeps pummeling the duvet. She's just so affectionate and so lovely aren't you? Yeah. You can see she just wants a bit of love and like I said, she hasn't even been with us for 24 hours yet, and this is what she's like, so she just left us now. I'm sorry I look a mess, I don't know if you can see me or not, and I'm in my pyjamas, but I wanted to show you her. So we got, um, we got her from the Blue Cross, so we adopted her in the same place that we adopted Ozzy. We decided that we wanted so to go to the same got Ozzy. It was really quick and yeah, we really thought they were a really pleasant place to go. So if you're looking to adopt a cat, adopt a cat, please consider going to a rescue. I just couldn't pressure it enough how much you should go to a rescue. They even have kittens in the rescues. So if you're looking for a kitten, they might have just been abandoned by their mum and then they found them and then that's why they're in the rescue. It doesn't mean that they're ill or anything. I'd really recommend you go to rescues. I, I'm so yes. rescued buying cats in pet shops. It's unbelievable. There's so many in the wild that need homes. I'm sorry you can see the tripod here. Um, let me just move it out of the way. Sorry, Tiggs. Um, so yeah, please consider going to a rescue if you'd like any, um, a, like. <laughs> oh dear. If you'd like, <laughs> she's attacking me. Uh, <laughs> tripod. If you'd like any um, like a review on the Blue Cross, maybe I'd be happy to do that. I'd really be happy to um, do a review on on and the process and everything. If you're more interested in that, I don't know whether anyone would be, but yeah, I'll be talking about how we got her, um, how the Blue Cross was, what we went through, sort of thing. I'll be telling you about Tig story, so don't you worry. Um, but yeah, so Tiggy is her real name, but we're gonna call her Tiggs because we don't like the name Tiggy. Um, I want to call her Tinkerbell or Princess but I'm <laughs> not allowed because apparently it's too girly but in my mind she's a princess and a um, Tinkerbell. Yeah. She's so gorgeous. She's a girl and Ozzy was a boy so that's quite nice to have a little change uh, but she is so relaxed and 
so contempt, but when she gets bored she meows the house down to let you know. She is gorgeous and we all love her to pieces and I hope that she'll become a part of YouTube yeah, soon. She's a little gem. She tends, apparently she likes to go outside. She used to live with two dogs and a cat, so she's used to socialising with other pets. Um, and she's already became quite friendly with the hamsters, if I'm honest. How about you? Taken great notice to them. <laughs> um, so yeah, in the future my mum wants a dog, which would be great. So she can socialise with the dog. 